Hey yo, what's good, homies? We about to be litty, no cap. You found the Madden plug. Now hit that like, hit that subscribe, and turn that naughty bell on. I'm about to put you on. Coin making methods, no money spent tips, budget beats on the 500 bands, 300 bands, 100 bands. Whatever you need, I got you. I got that daily Madden work. Now let's get it. Hey yo, what the fuck? Nigga saying they don't suck. No outside. Send it out and we gon' slot. Another one. Air it out when we arrive. Dumping that shit when they don't with the smoke. Damn, son. Say hey yo. Hey yo. No shmoney spent gang. We in a building and you know that. What is shaking, y'all? You already know what time it is, man. Holla at me. If you're new to the channel, man, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and turn that naughty bell to fruck on. We is all the way to fruck. Let you dig. You already know. With that being said, man, if it's your first time on this channel, man, I focus on grab statistics just like this. And I do this type of graph for every single promo that comes out. And what I'm doing on this graph is I'm looking for the best, the cheapest cards. These other YouTubers that tell you cop this, buy, buy this card, buy that card, buy this card. I'm here to help you save some chicken, man. I would never tell you to cop something. I wouldn't rock. You dig what I'm saying? With that being said, man, like I said, I do this type of graph for every single promo that comes out throughout the week. And every single Friday, I drop a shopping list for you to go shopping Friday and Saturday, and then on Sunday, I update the Budget Beast team that I'm taking on for the week, man. You already know, so let's get right into it. We're going to go over to all the positions, and we're going to get the best, the cheapest cards for you to save some chicken, catch some doves. You already know. Now, we're going to leave QB for last, man, because that one is the most arguable. That's the most debatable. Let me rephrase that. That's the most debatable when it comes to that position. So let's go over to running back. Now, when it comes to running back, listen, truthfully, there's only going to be, listen, at this point in the game, yes, we care about statistics. Absolutely. Listen, without a doubt, we frux with the stats. Okay. But now, because everybody is so high up on statistics, we need abilities to kind of um, balance that out, to, to separate them. You dig what I'm saying? When it comes to running back, what you would like in your best scenario is something like a uh, angry runs. With that being said, to me, the best running back right now is going to be 96 overall, Bo Jack, for the simple fact that he gets angry runs for one AP. Bro, the dude is lit. Okay, now he has gone up in price a little bit, up to 300K, and that's because people are realizing that this is the best running back, okay? Now, please keep in mind, prices will change. I'm on a little later than most of you guys. And right now, not as many people are playing Madden as they used to be. So late nights, my prices are going to look way different than yours, all right? So, let's talk about it. Bo Jack, best running back in the game. Trust me, you do not want to pass this up. This card is lit. If you cannot get this card right here, the next card that I would suggest for you to cop, or you tired of Bo Jack and you want something different, right? I'm going to suggest you get beast mode okay i like this card man same thing angry runs now because he's a ltd you want to cop him somewhere around 400k because he comes with a 350 quick sell value it's like a savings account okay because you're always going to keep that 350 quick sell value in theory you would if you paid 400 you're only paying 50 bands for the card in this case since he's 490 you actually only really paying about 140k on top of box you feel me anyways the next card I'm going to be talking about is going to be Emmett Smith. Now, Emmett Smith is a steal. Going for about 160 bands, bro. Look, he comes with angry runs as well, too. Now, he doesn't come with as much as, like, look. He comes with 90 trucking compared to 
Bojack's 94, and then Beast Mode comes with like a 97. So that's like that's the only real statistic that you know what I mean really separates them all. At the end of the day, to me, the most glitchiest one is gonna be Bojack. And you, trust me, you're gonna go and want to get that card. That card is gonna last you the rest of the year, more than likely, because of the angry ones. Now, when it comes to fullback, there's only two fullbacks that really, three that that you really want to cop. Okay, if you're focused more on speed and you want the fastest fullback out there in the game right now, it's gonna be Alec Ingle. But he's going for a hefty price, Brodies. You really want to drop a bag on homeboy? I don't know. He's only a 96 speed, okay? Now, if you want someone that has the speed but better blocking, I'm going to suggest you get 95 overall Michael Burton. Card is heat. 170 bands. At the, oh, man, I went the wrong way. At the end of the day, 94 speed, 93 run block, 98 lead block, 96 impact block, and this card is lit. Now, if you're trying to run through homies... Get yourself Mike Allstar. Now, Mike Allstar is going to be, what is he, 90, 94 speed, 83 run block, 87 lead blocking, 94 impact blocking, but he also does come with some notable um, abilities. He comes with Bruiser for 1 AP, Tank 1 AP. Um, you can get Armbar for 2 AP. You don't want to pay that. But Bruiser and Tank, bro, that's all you really need, all right? Now, let's go into... Wide receiver, okay? Wide receiver. Now, if you want to get a 98 speed wide receiver right now, it's not going to be as cheap as you want it to be. This is going to be the truth. To me, the best 98 wide receiver that is out there is going to be Nico Collins. Now, he's going up in price. Believe me, homies. If you've been following the channel, when I told you to cop the joint, he was at like a little bit over three. You feel me? You could have got him and you should have got him for free through the Easter promo. And I definitely put that video out for you guys to get. So make sure you follow the channel. Subscribe, man, because I'll be dropping fire. You dig what I'm saying? If you cannot afford this type of chicken right here for the bull right there, okay? 400 and something bands. He's going to go down in price, especially tomorrow when Randy Moss drops. He's going to go down in price. Go snatch this card up, bro. Believe me, he's worth, yo, listen, he's worth every coin, bro. Yo, he is lit, he is glitchy, he is turned, okay? Now, the, the dope part about Nico Collins is that he does come with Nightmare Mitch Match for 0 AP and Route Tech for 1 AP. And Route Tech is something that you want on your wide receivers. Now, the second one, 98 speed that I'm going to tell you get is going to be Christian Watson. For the simple fact, just because 98 speed, no crazy discounted abilities, but 98 speed at 6'4", still lit, 290 bands, the ball will turn the fuck up for you. Okay, now, we're also going to talk about someone else, all right? Now, those two are your 98 speed wide receivers. You, you get those two plus Justin Jefferson, you golden, brodies. Okay? The next one I'm going to be talking about is going to be... Where's, where's Ocho Cinco, bro? Ocho Cinco is lit. I, I can't even find the ball. What is he? Is he a He's a 97, right? Or oh, he's a 98, right? Let's go check out Ocho Cinco, okay? Ocho Cinco, 370 bands. I like this card just for the simple fact. 97 speed, 96 spec catch, 6-1, okay? Now, you, you're asking yourself, like, why why you like Ocho Cinco? I'm going to tell you why. I like Ocho Cinco, man. I like Ocho Cinco for the simple fact that number one, he has a 96 pet catch, 97 speed, okay? And he comes with route tech for 180, okay? And that's really one of the ones you want. And you, he also comes with, he comes with third down threat for zero AP. He also comes with outside apprentice for zero AP. Like this card is lit and it's two discounted ability buckets so you're able to mix and match those for like one AP. You did what I'm saying? So it's a fire situation. The next one that I really, really like the most too is going to be 97 overall, Chris Collinsworth. And I know I spoke about this card a lot before. Um, He's still lit, bro. He's just for the simple fact, and I'm going to tell you why right now, once I pull up his down. Okay. He comes with red zone threat for zero AP and deep elite for one AP. Okay. So deep elite is deep out and deep in. After 20 yards. You dig what I'm saying? So he's going to be turned. Okay. And he's 6'5 for 240 bands. At the end of the day, you can't go wrong with any of these four wide receivers. Okay. Now let's go over to tight end. Okay. 
But listen, if you guys look, let's go back to why let's go back to wide receivers, okay? Now, if you guys are looking, okay, for like a stock, stock nine, but no abilities, just regular clear outs and all of that. Look, my man Marquise Brown, right here, okay, 97 speed. What's he? About 60 bands. What is it? 60 bands for the ball, okay? Easy shmoney, right? Who else? There's there's a couple there's a couple of them there's like four of them or like three of them actually okay Jameson Williams is another one 120 bands like I said this is stock speed 97 no discounted abilities nothing crazy you need some clear outs Jameson Williams Marquise Brown and then there's one uh, I think it's Isaiah McKenzie Isaiah McKenzie he he's a 97 stock speed as well too problem is he's only like five eight. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, do you really want to use board as like 5'8"? Not really, right? <laughs> let's, let's keep it real. You know what I'm saying? Look, is that him right there? Do not pay. Who put the ball for 500 bands? Yo, y'all, y'all here smoking. <laughs> y'all, y'all here smoking. Man, stop playing, man. <laughs> Yo, dudes is wild. At this time of the year, you're going to see, you're going to see shit like that all the time, bro. It's just funny. Anyways, tight end. I like this card a lot. 98 speed Musgrave, man. And it's for the simple fact that he is an LTD. And y'all know how I feel about LTDs, man. You saving some money, okay? 99 spec catch. Do you see what I'm saying? 6'6. Six, six. 99 spec catch. The ball comes with Nightmare Mismatch for 0 AP and Red Zone Threat for 1 AP. And he is 6'6. Six, six. He is an LTD going for 426 bands. You cop the ball. You only really paying 70 bands for the jump. Is you digging what I'm saying? Holla at me, all right? Now, the next card that I like the most, okay? At tight end. Okay, what, what is he, a 96? Nah, he can't be. Is he a 96? <laughs> Yo, I'll be bugging, right? <laughs> Yo, 96 overall, Bo Jack. Listen, this card is he. He be turning up for me. Now, he doesn't have the same spec catch. Yo, where the fuck is the ball at, man? 96 overall Bo Jack. I don't even know where homie at right now. He's not even popping up for me. Okay, this is how you know I'm on late night. 96 overall Bo Jack. You should be able to get him for about like 200, 260, 260 bands, okay? The ball's lit. Why'd I go to 95? I'm tripping. The ball's lit, okay? He also comes with tight end apprentice for 0 AP, bruiser 0 AP, deep elite 1 AP, okay? Bo Jack. 96 overall. Obviously, I can't find them right now. I'm on too late. All right. Now, who else? Musgrave and Bo Jack. That's the only tight ends you need. Let's go into cornerback. When it comes to cornerback, the best, okay, the best ability right now that you want to get on your on your corners, your DBs, all of them, is deep zone KO because that's deep in and is deep out zone KO together, and we want it for one AP. Okay. The one who gets a 1 AP, and I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna tell you straight up, Brian Branch gets it for 1 AP, and what's dope about him, he's an LTD as well too, and he's not going for too much bread, the other day he was going for like 400, you feel me, this dude, 99 speed, okay, yes sir, 99 speed, deep zone KO for 1 AP, pick artist 0 AP, balls lit, same thing with Marshawn Lattimore, Marshawn Lattimore is a little bit cheaper, he's a little bit shorter, now, Brian Branch is six foot, so is Lattimore, okay? 380 bands, and he comes with deep zone KO for one AP, pick artist for zero AP. Just off top, those two right there, they're going to hold it down for you, okay? Now, we're going to go over to some 97s because there's some, there's some 97s, they, they're going to hold you down too, okay? One of them that I like the most, and I'm going to tell you straight up, still, where is he at? Bo Jack. Now, when it comes to Bo Jack, 240 bands, he's a stock 98 speed. He comes with an X Factor pre lit. Okay, you're gonna have to pay the 1 AP, but it's gonna be dual threat. Without that dual threat, you're gonna, yo, he's shaky, baby. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> he's shaky, but you put that dual threat on, he gonna turn up for you. 98 speed, he gonna hold it down. All right, now. Another one that I like the most is going to be Patrick Sertain for the simple fact that Patrick Sertain comes with Deep Zone KO for 1 AP. Yes, you see what I'm saying? You see the trend? That's what we're going with. Okay, Deep Zone KO for 1 AP. 
Gardner does not get that, but he's only a 97 speed, 6'2". So this is another card that we want because of the deep zone. And you can mix and match these dudes. Once you get that ability on your corner, you can mix and match these dudes all over the field. Pause, because that sounded super weird. But that's what, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what you want to do. You want to have that ability. By having that, that ability on all your DBs, you good, bro. These, believe me, you can mix and match everywhere. Here is Sauce Gardner. Now, Sauce Gardner was going for about 280 bands. Do not get got out there, please. Okay? Sauce Gardner, pick artist, 0 AP, flat zone KO, 0 AP, mid zone KO, 0 AP, inside shade, 1 AP. And y'all know he's a stock 98 speed. The ball is glitchy, and he's going to turn the fuck up for you. Okay? Now, let's go over the free safety. When it comes to free safety, okay, you got to get Justin Simmons. What ability does he have? Yes, sir. Deep zone KO for 1 AP. This is what I'm talking about. Now, he's going to be about 300 bands, but he's going to be worth every coin, especially up top. Pause, all right? He's going to hold it down for you. Easy money. You know what I mean? The ball, the ball, the ball is 6 2. Pick artist 0 AP, deep zone KO 1 AP. That's all you need. That's it. Now, another one that I like, truthfully, and it's going to be a 97 overall, it's going to be Ed Reed. Now, Ed Reed is going to be a 96 speed, okay? And I get that he's a little bit slower. You could cop Jesse Bates, but Jesse Bates is about 400K. You're going to pay a little bit more, but he as well comes with Deep Zone KO for 1 AP. He's 6'1", pick artist, 0 AP. I would much rather go with Deep Zone KO. You feel me? Anyway, whatever. But he's 97 speed. He's just a little bit pricier, Okay. Now, you can get Ed Reed, and Ed Reed, you can pick and choose. I would much rather go with Jesse Bates, but if you can get Ed Reed, same thing, except Ed Reed's going to be a 96 speed. Jesse Bates, 97 speed. However, Ed Reed gets pick artists for 0 AP and deep zone KO for 1 AP. Same situations. This, this is what you're going to see. This is what you need. So these three cards is lit. My number one would be Justin Simmons, then Jesse Bates, and then Ed Reed. That's how I would cop them, especially around 300K. When the prices start to drop, if you can't cop these dudes now, be on the lookout. Keep them on your radar. The minute you see them slip up on the price on the 300K, around 300K, go cop the joint. Don't wait. All right? Now, honorable mention to add strong safety is going to be Taylor Rapp. And Taylor Rapp, 97 stock speed. Not a bad card. Problem is, he doesn't come with nothing crazy, all right? Now, he does come with Lurk Artist for 0 AP, but then that's really about it. You know what I'm saying, man? There's, there's really no great abilities, but he does have a 97 speed. So shout out to him for the speed, but we need abilities, right? Because that's, that's what we care about. Now, as strong safety, I know it's a 96, but Jair Brown, I didn't even see him up right now. Jair Brown, okay? Still he. Still he. Jair Brown, Super Bowl present, 95. Oh, he's a 95. 95 overall, 96 speed. And this is why I say that Ed Reed is still liable. Because if Jair Brown still going to turn up at 96 speed, then Brody's, so can Ed Reed. All right? Now, I can't find Jair Brown. There he is right there. Okay? 150 bands. This is a steal. Now, if for some reason you don't like rap, you don't like Jair, you want something faster, right? You want something just a little bit faster. Let me show you something, okay? And this is this this if you want it, this is something I would do. Y'all know I y'all know I'd be crazy with it. You feel me? I'm gonna go over the corner back and I'm gonna show y'all something, right? Real quick. Because we're talking about strong safety. This Charles Woods, alright? This Charles Woods is right here. Peep game. Okay, peep game. You can put this Charles Woods in here as a free safety or strong safety. And you're like, yo, why do we want Charles Woods in the morning? 6 1, 97 speed, 97 man, 97 zone, 97 press. Okay? And then I'm going to remind you that the ball got a 90 spec catch. Right? Crazy. And, and you saying, yo, you saying, yo, Montana, what does is, what is spec catch have anything to do with it, right? So who's the who's the glitchiest one of them all? Right? Who's the glitchiest one of them all? Let's find a strong safety real quick. That's the glitchiest one. Just so, just so I could show y'all what I'm talking about. Where's Kyle Hamilton? Isn't Kyle Hamilton around here? Did I pass him already? 
I just want to show y'all what I'm talking about. So you can be like, oh, all right, all right. I see what you're saying. I'm in corner. <laughs> I've driven. All right, I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to show y'all Kyle, Kyle Hamilton real quick, and then we're going to keep it pushing. All right, so Kyle Hamilton, right? Everybody be on his top. Let's keep it a 1,000, right? But when you look at Kyle Hamilton's bed catch, what do you see? A 76, right? 76. Chill, stop it, bro. You see, you see what I'm saying? But Charles Woodson has a 90. So come on, you understand? Like, like, like let's, let, let's keep it a 1,000, all right? You know what I mean? I'll keep it a 1,000 with y'all. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe and follow the motherfucking channel. You dig? Like I said, what's double bottom? Not no crazy this kind of business, but he does get deep out zone KO for one EP. He also gets pick artists for zero EP. He gonna turn the fuck up for you at the end of the day. You think what I'm saying? So that's that's what I like about Charles Woods. If you want to go in that route, for some reason you want a 97 speed, you want something different. There it is right there. Okay. Now let's talk about left outside linebacker. I know I know we got our subject there, but I just wanted to give you a little bit of my input. I right, pause. Chill, bro. Just chill. All right, at left outside linebacker, I'm going to give you, I would say, 96 overall, a rock pool, just for the simple fact that he can get unstoppable force, 262 bands. It's not a bad card, brodies, okay? That he does have a 70 man and an 82 zone. Not the greatest, but it's still solid. It's still solid. It's, it, it'll work. You know what I'm saying? Lurk Artist, 0 AP, no outsiders for 1 AP, Tackle Supreme, 1 AP, Extra Elite, 1 AP. Double or nothing for zero AP. All the abilities that we like on the edge rushers, he has plus unstoppable force. So yes, sir, I like this card. Okay, who else do I like? I like Leo Chanel, 95 overall. Leo Chanel, fire card still. Lurk artist, zero AP, mid zone okay, KO, one AP, no outsiders, one AP, and tackle supreme, one AP, and he's going for dirt cheap, 110 bands, bro. They don't tell me you cannot afford that. This card is stupid, bro. He's all right. Now, right outside linebacker. Let's talk about it. Right outside linebacker, bro. You should just be. Look, Mr. Monday Night. Just cobble. 50 bands. The ball's lit. This dude, listen. And he's an AKA. You want a real good blitzer? My man Derek Thomas still turned. 80 bands. Easy shmoney. You want the fastest right outside linebacker in the game? We're going to go see him right now, okay? And that is going to be. Bojack, 96 overall, and he's not going for crazy bread either. Shaquille Barrett, I like Shaquille Barrett right here, 200 bands. Problem is, he doesn't get, um, what is it, um, Lurk Artist for a discounted ability. That's, that's the only thing with Shaquille Barrett. Other than that, I think that Shaquille Barrett card is, I think it's lit. It's, it's fire. Believe me when I tell you, it's fire. No outsiders, 0 AP, Edge Strategy for 1 AP, and Tackle Supreme for 1 AP. Two discounted ability buckets so you can't mix and match. Anyways, we're not talking about him. We're talking about Bo Jack, 300 bands, the fastest right outside linebacker in the game. I just wanted to look at the stats, bro. Do you stop playing with me? Okay? Let's just take a look, just so you guys can't see. 98 speed, 94 block shed, 97 power move, 84 finesse move. And he comes, right? Pre-lit, dual threat for one AP. Just go cop Bojack. Truthfully, like, just go do it. You put Bojack on one side, you put a rock pool on the other one, you'd be like, hey, yo. Hey, yo, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Like, it'll be it'll be like, yo, <laughs> rage quit. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, middle linebacker. Without a, without a doubt, you should have Isaiah Simmons. What does he have? Deep zone KO for 1 AP. This again, this is dude. You're like, yo, why you keep saying, yo, because once you have this sh all over the field, Brody, bro, you're gonna be turned. Lurk artist, zero AP, Isaiah Simmons, I'm fucks with it. The other card that I really like is gonna be Fred Warner. Once he goes down in price, I wouldn't cop him at 450. Y'all yeah, know me, I'm cheap. I cop him like at 300. So no, I'm not paying 450 bands for the ball. But if y'all wanna pay it, he's fired. In the meantime, I would definitely cop Devin White only for the simple fact that he is a 96 speed. Nothing really too crazy, 
about this card, I mean, Lurk Artist, Mizzo KO 1 AP, Mr. Big Stop 1 AP, Enforcer 1 AP. Not, like I said, nothing crazy. I like the, I like, you gotta pick and choose between Lurk Artist and Mid Zone. That's, that's, that's the gimmick. You see what I'm saying? Anyways, at left end. Now, listen, at this point in the game, you wanna have some pre lit X factors on your D line just to, you know what I mean? You, you wanna show red. You wanna, you, you wanna show, you wanna show your, the dude you playing, that you ain't playing no games. And once they see some pre-lit X-Factors, they gonna be a little shaky, right? Matter Beastie, 80 bands, pre-lit X-Factor, Unstoppable Force, go get the ball. I recommend Reggie White, still still fire. 190 bands, pre-lit X-Factor, Unstoppable Force, 89 speed though, but 96 blocks hit, 96 power move, 95 finesse move, this card will turn the fuck off you. Now you want something a little faster, you want something a little crazier, Carloftis, you're gonna pay a little bit more for him though. I copped the LTD joint because I wanted to save some bread. You smell me? So that's something that I would do. 600 bands, I would not pay. I would pay somewhere around 400 for the card. Now, if I've been following the channel, I told you how to cop this card the other day. He was dirt cheap. He was going for about, what, like four? You can still get him for four. Believe me, you can. You just gotta be patient or catch him on the weekday, like on the weekend, Friday or Saturday, like tomorrow. Like early morning when people are popping packs go and they run into this joint, they gonna be cutting throat and you could catch a lick. You dig what I'm saying? No, not that type of lick. If you from the hood, you know exactly what I'm talking about. You dig? All right, let's talk about it. Right end. At right end, to me, the most OP card in the game is gonna be Tribute Aaron Down. The dope part about that is that they gave away, <laughs> because of that card, the price dropped on this card. And this card is fire just for the simple fact that the ball gets edge strategy for 1 AP, strip specialist for 0 AP, no outside is 0 AP, secure tackle 0 AP, unpredictable for 0 AP. Ball is stacked, 260 bands. This is a steal. This is probably the best one right here. Now, you don't want to pay 200 and something bands, you know what I mean? You want something just a little bit cheaper. Chase Young, at the end of the day, is still lit. Any dirt cheap, he's not going for a lot of bread. 112 bands, the ball, look, 95 speed, 96 block shed, 90 power move, 97 finesse move. And yes, sir, Chase Young comes with no outsiders for zero AP, double not the one AP, buy one, get one zero AP. Um, edge threat for two AP, we don't want that, but all the other ones is lit, all right. Now, Aaron Donald Young, you fire, okay. Uh, at DT, there's only two options you should be considering at this point. At this point in the game, there should only be two joints that you're willing to cop. You could cop Vita Vea. He does get inside stuff. I don't remember if it's for one. Does he get it for one? Let me see. I'll tell you right now. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Vita Vea. Yeah, he gets inside stuff for one EP, but he's slow as dirt. The, the, Brody, the Brody's like 82 speed. Like, you don't want that. Who you want is Warren Sapp. That's who you want. 140, 140 bands, second fastest DT in the game, alongside Oliver. Okay, Ed Oliver, he as well gets inside stuff. Both of these dudes get inside stuff for one AP. All right, you get both of these zones on your D line. If you need two DTs, they're gonna be turned to fuck up. Now, as far as kicker goes, who I like the most, and this is gonna be the last card. Oh no no, we're gonna go to QB. Let's go to QB real fast. Okay. At QB, arguably, this is arguably, we're going to go over who I think is better. And when I say better, I say AP-wise. Because you guys want, look, at this point in the game, you want the most available AP possible. So we're going to go over, we're going to go over the best release in the game. And that's going to be traditional four. Or at least that's what people argue that it is. Alright? So... Number one, Bo Jack, 290 bands. You can get a discounted AP stack for about three to five, six at the most AP for this bull, depending on your, your play style, okay? Now, who else? Traditional four. Traditional four release. The next one after him that you would want to cop is going to be Doug Williams' Super Bowl pass. Where is he at? And he not going for a lot of bread. You can still cop him. And turn the fuck up for him. Okay. Purdy was lit too, by the way. 190 bands for the ball, Doug Williams. You can still cop him. 
Do not pay 240 for the ball. 100, look, 100, look, you probably, that's a dirt cheap price. Okay, if you don't get Bojack, get Doug Williams. Traditional four release. Slinger three release. And I've been saying this for a couple weeks now. To me, the best one, four, five, no, for four AP, you could get the stack with Josh Allen for 300 bands. This is a steal right here. There's, there's certain releases in the game that are always going to be popular, okay? Right now, it's going to be traditional four, slinger three, and slinger one. Slinger one and slinger three are classics, okay? Josh Allen has one of those classic releases. Now, the next one after that is going to be slinger one, which is, it should be traditional four, number one, and then slinger one, number two, and then slinger three, number three. So, with slinger one, the best one right now, is going to be Will Levis, and you get an AP stack for about what, five? Is it five? I'll tell you right now. It's gonna be a five AP stack, okay? Josh Allen, you get it for four. That's Hot Route Master, Gunslinger, and Sefi Lee. Problem is, you're gonna pay a little grip for Will Levis because every everybody's jumping on his top. You feel me? Once everybody's jumping on his top, the price go up. Now, I've been using Slinger One Release, Joe Flacco, okay? I have the 96 overall because I can never find a 97. But you could get a nice AP stack with the ball for about 6 AP. Not too bad, not terrible. You want it, you want to be somewhere around in between three and five, truthfully. To be as, as productive as possible with your AP. You smell me? He got it for 240 bands. Alright? You want something a little bit better, something with the sling of one release. I suggest you go and get Aaron Rodgers. But Aaron Rodgers is slower, okay? But he does have what's called Pass Lead Elite, which is official tissue. It's the better version of Set Feet Lead. You smell me? Now, one that I'm gonna tell you that is still fire to me is gonna be this 96 overall Pat Mahomes, but don't get got for it, okay? And yes, you can get a nice AP stack with him as well for about 5 AP. I would get the LTD though. But if you can't, the Redux is just as good. You just It's going to lose value. It's going to depreciate. Okay? One card that I want to try out, and the reason why is because it does have the past lead to lead. Okay? And that's going to be Terry Bradshaw. I want to try this card. The Blonde Bomber was popping in the beginning of the year. Traditional 2 release. Okay? But you're going to be able to get a 3 AP stack with him as well. You just got to do the challenges. You can get Pass Lead Elite, Gunslinger, and Sefi Lead along with Fearless for like 4 to 5 AP. To me, I think this is the guy I'm going for. Okay. Um, that's going to be it, bro. At the end of the day, if you want to kick it, go get Butker because he has this kind of abilities. The playoff one, official. You're going to pay like 90000 for him. I'll just show you him real quick. All right? That way, there's, there's no hiccups. Okay, it, it's it's not hard, bro. Like at the end of the day, you don't have to get like the, the, the most expensive kicker ever. You just gotta get one that's that's gonna turn up for you. Okay, and for me, okay, it is gonna be Butker. Okay, hundred bands. He gonna kick the sh out of everything in sight. You dig? If this video helped you out, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and turn that naughty bell to fuck on you dig. <laughs>